to our international participants in person and online, welcome to Rwanda. To our national participants um, from Rwanda, your friends, you are welcome. Welcome to this representative panel workshop under the theme, building a consensus on what constitutes effective school leadership in Africa. On behalf uh, of Honorable Minister of Education, Republic of Rwanda, I am pleased to welcome you to this panel uh, workshop regarding building a consensus on school leadership in Africa. I recognize the support of our partners, uh, mainly the Belgian government, VVOB, and the MasterCard Foundation in the organization of this important event. During the 13th Policy Dialogue Forum of the International Task Force on Teachers, uh, hosted here in Kigali on 2nd December 2021, we made a statement uh, that the Ministry of Education, in, co in collaboration with partners, we are in the process of establishing an African Center uh, for School Leadership with the aim of supporting governments in Africa to build the capacity in promoting effective school leadership for improved quality of teaching and learning outcomes. Uh, thank you very much, VVOB, for your invitation. This school leadership is a very important subject for UNESCO ICBA. We work on teacher development in Africa and the school leadership is probably something we should have paid more attention. So I'm really looking forward to learning more. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. Uh, my name is Pauline Essa, and I'm the Director of Research and Insight for an organization called Education Sub-Saharan Africa. It's so great to meet many of you in person, finally. We've corresponded on, on email and, and, and on Zoom calls. So great work here, and I, I look forward to contributing to this important discussion. Thank you. I uh, thank VVOB for the invitation and for the opportunity to contribute to the research. So I work at the University of Nottingham as Professor of Educational Leadership. I'm also currently the President of the British Educational Leadership Management and Administration Society. Hello everybody, good uh, morning. Uh, my name is Kwame Achampong. I'm a Professor of International Education and Development at the Open University. And uh, we've been doing some work on teachers and uh, head teachers in Ghana, uh, but also uh, in in, the, in in some parts of um, uh, uh, the sub region in, in in West Africa. So I'm, I'm very pleased to 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 be here. I'm looking forward to the discussions. Thank you. We believe that uh, uh, if we improve the quality of our leaders, let women also be included there, and let us focus also on ensuring that there is uh, gender equality in education from school level to leadership and even to teachers. And today I sit where I am in charge of uh, developing the skills of teachers and the school leaders. And this is the only solution to providing quality, relevant and inclusive education to the African child with mixed results actually with the South African research. And it's a problem, I think you touched on it as well, Felix, perhaps others have already done it, the symbolism issue. So the government says, everyone must have a school management team. So what do they do? They set up a school management team. Half the ones we studied never met. But if you ask them, do you have a school management team? Oh yes, we have a school management team. And then of the others that did met, they didn't talk about curriculum. They planned the school trips. I was really interested in these CPD models. I wondered if you have come across with some difference in uh, uh, leadership in the different levels of uh, schooling, namely, uh, I don't know whether uh, preschools or kindergartens were in, uh, in your research, but maybe primary and secondary might have a slightly different uh, kind of uh, leadership uh, characteristics or, or, and also maybe boarding and non-boarding schools, as well as um, urban and rural or private uh, versus uh, uh, government schools. Thank you. Best practice can only be defined in context. I think that's really very important. A little bit about curriculum in Zimbabwe, a lot of discussion around bureaucracy in Nigeria. 
we could have a whole research program about the effects of bureaucracy in Africa, couldn't we? But we won't, perhaps won't go there. And a little bit about school-based management. And in, in Egypt, a surprising context. I wasn't expecting that. I think what happens in South Africa, which doesn't seem to happen in other parts of the continent, is supporting people to do the research through the NRF, which provides grants and you know money for people to be able to conduct a research and through which people can also uh, be uh, upgraded as, as, as it were through NRF rating, uh, rating you know, systems. Based on the review from uh, uh, from Dr. T T Professor Tony and Felix, we saw that actually there's a less um, show, uh, evidence around the impact of CPD. I think this is also something that you uh, we, we reach uh, consensus upon. Agreed. How important school leadership is, and um, I would like to commend Rwanda and the VBLB for engaging uh, different partners at the early stage. I think we, know, we all know the pro famous proverb, if you want to go fast, go alone. If you want to go far, go with others. So I think we are going with others because the journey is going to be long. But if we are all together, it will, we will go. This initiative has been inclusive. We've listened to everybody. We've listened to research. We've listened to each other, and I reiterate again, the future is with us here today. Thank you. The host country, the host government will be always ready to work in close collaboration with other members from other African countries. See already uh, the center is in action, uh, looking at uh, us in the room from different countries. We are all looking forward to this. We see it as very strong tools going to support all of us to move forward and support uh, uh, quality education. Uh, and what Tony had said around policy theory, research and practice, if we can, if the center can be doing more of what has just been done in this foundational issue, uh, foundational paper, this is gonna be uh, quite, quite excellent. Uh, and again, on, on that statement that we are going together, uh, and that we will go a far way. At the same time, we want to go together at a good pace as well, right? Thank you very much. Uh, it has been very rich and it has been uh, very, very motivating. And I think as a team, Government of Rwanda, VVB, as a technical partner, we feel now really backed um, and strengthened in, in, in this effort. I would like to thank uh, very much the Belgian government uh, for what uh, they are doing for this effective school leadership. Uh, I thank also MasterCard Foundation for uh, support specifically for this uh, empirical research. Um, we thank all um, professors uh, who uh, tried to join us and uh, explain exactly their feelings and uh, sure i'm very happy that uh, um, what was as a dream before it's become reality now thank you all 